The last major topic in this domain on understanding the cloud involves differentiating among different types of cloud services. For starters, there are three major types of cloud services you need to know about for the exam. Let's look at the first one, IaaS, or Infrastructure as a Service. Here in Azure, we see the beginnings of it with this lone virtual machine. IaaS provides hardware for servers, networking, and storage. Cost is based on what you get and how much of it. This is the most complete type of cloud service because just about everything is hosted in the cloud. A step down from IaaS is PaaS, Platform as a Service. Whereas IaaS hosts hardware and client apps, PaaS hosts just the hardware and server apps. As an example, I could add a SQL Server to this virtual environment if I want to, and then build and host any app connecting to the database locally, using programming languages like C-sharp or Java to connect to this cloud server. Again, PaaS does not host client apps. IaaS does. Last and most common to users, we have SaaS, Software as a Service. In essence, SaaS is software that is hosted in the cloud and does not need to be installed on a client machine. Many email providers such as Gmail, Hotmail, and Outlook for Office 365 fit this description. So does this, Word Online. This is a little limited compared to the desktop version of Word, but I did not have to install this, and I can get most Word tasks done. Google Docs is another popular SaaS tool.